Inclusion means that every person in a community should have full participation opportunities and that includes people with disabilities. We benefit greatly by having the full participation of all members of society. We become empathetic and understanding. We appreciate the contributions and a different way of looking at life. The Scardi Center is a beautiful place where people with disabilities of all ages come for education, employment, and empowerment opportunities. It's a great place to work and a great place to be. Hi, I'm John Kemp, President and CEO of the Viscardi Center and Henry Viscardi School in Albertson, Long Island. Hold on, give somebody else a chance. So JetBlue got involved with the Viscardi Center approximately four years ago when, uh, when we visited the facility and we were able to meet the students. Right then we knew that uh, the Viscardi Center was something that we really wanted to be a part of. These are tremendously empathetic children who not only look out for each other in their classrooms and in the school, but they look out now for the for society that they're going into and, and live in. And that I think they're going to be great citizens of this world. They're going to contribute, they're going to give, and not always take. When I look at how we partner with each other and why it makes sense, it's because we learn from each other too. The students have learned uh, different things when it comes to travel. Priority flight. All right, now you're flying. We put together this flight, which takes students from JFK to Boston. It's an all-day event, such an experience for them, but also a learning experience for us at JetBlue. What we learn from the students is, as an airline, the accessibility may not always be 100%. So what do we need to do as an airline to become much more accessible to individuals with disabilities? Ask them what their needs are, they'll tell you. Say hello, ask them what their name is, use their name while you talk with them, and then as you go through the process, ask them, you know, make sure you make it clear to them that whatever their needs are, you're there to help. There's basic ideas that you should, as crew members, understand that, you know, there's disability culture and how you always want to talk to somebody with respect and dignity and assume they are completely understanding everything you're saying. Your crew members did absolutely amazing. They have a different understanding of that all people don't get lifted the same way and that there's always a second or a different way to do something. That's got it. Nice job. And you scooted back far enough, you think? I think you did a really great job and I've been doing this a long time. <laughs> On July 9th, here in New York City, we participated in the 27th Annual ADA Disability Parade. This was our third year doing it as we partnered with the Viscardi Center. It's a special day for the students of the Viscardi Center because it's a day that they are actually on stage for all the right reasons. The Disability Pride Parade is an essential element for people with disabilities to celebrate their identity of disability out, loud, and proud about who we are as people with disabilities. So when JetBlue comes to us and we partner with you, we think about the big, broad world that we live in and how we're going to be able to experience life and the different jobs and the different places that we can go and, and the different cultures we're going to experience. That's what I think our students gain from this partnership. When, when individuals ask me when it comes to how do you partner with, uh, you know, with an organization, uh, I, I'm, I'm a big believer in if you have a passion, if you have a drive or a motivation within yourself and you're able to connect with someone else who believes or feels the same thing, then it's going to work. But what I really like most about our relationship is it expands the understanding of humanity and hopefully it inspires us all. <laughs>